my friends and family welcome to my youtube channel if you're new here welcome if you've been here before thank you so much for choosing my channel my name is rose i always bring you beauty tips and health tips in today's video guys i'm going to show you how you can make your lip balm at home using beetroot yes guys we're going to use beetroot to make our lip balm that is so natural and beautiful to beautify our mouth without using any chemical without using any any preservative you're going to make that amazing lip balm using beetroot so guys if you don't know beetroot this is what we call beetroot yes you can make use of this to make your lip balm and you look so so beautiful like me i don't have any lipstick but still i can wear my lips and go out just by using my lip balm which i made myself using beetroot so this is our beetroot what we are going to do you get a plate like this one you can see i have two beetroots here but i'm going to make use of one you get a knife like this one then you peel your beetroot and remove the skin because you don't need the skin so you just do like this carefully you peel off the peel like you can see i'm doing you peel off the peel like I'm doing nicely and make sure you don't cut your beetroot so just like this I'm removing the peel Oops, guys you see this is how my beetroot is like after I have removed the peel so what I'm going to do I'm going to dice this and put it in the blender so I get my pot chopping board and then I chop my beetroot like so see I cut it into pieces and then I dice it because I want to blend it so you chop you chop like this and then you dice it into small pieces which can be blended nicely i dice this as well So after that, I get my blender and then I put my chopped beetroot or diced beetroot in the blender. Like this, I put in this blender. I'm going to add some little water, then I go and blend this. You see guys how it looks so beautiful in here. So I'm going to add some little water and then I put this cover and I blend. I'll come back and show you how I can get juice from this. So guys, after I have blended my beetroot, I go ahead and strain and get out its juice. This is how it looks, so beautiful. Then I'm going to use this strainer and then get out the juice from this beetroot. Let me get a smaller strainer. You can put this on the side and then I can be able to strain my beetroot and get out the juice. It looks so young, it looks so beautiful guys this is the juice as you can see so these residues can be used for some other purposes like you can use them to do your scrub you can get beetroot powder yeah i'm not going to throw them away i'm going to make use of them for some other things so i can put them here ahead and strain all the juice you have and then you make use of it as you can see this is how it looks so beautiful so yummy yeah you can see the residues they can make good scrub guys don't throw them away you can make use of them for something else so today we are only concentrating on the juice so guys this is how our juice is like so beautiful you can drink this it has so many 
the advantages in your body many many calcium vitamins whatever you can think of so many advantages of taking beetroot juice but today we're only concentrating on our juice to make our lip balm yeah we are tired of using lipstick all the time you can wear lip balm sometimes or you can use your lipstick no problem but sometimes you can use these natural ingredients and they can save you lots and lots of time so what you are going to do we need is our bowl where we're going to mix our beetroot lip balm from so we put the juice aside and then we get our vaseline this is so important guys everyone should have vaseline in the house because it has so many many advantages you must use vaseline always in your recipes beauty recipes it is 100 percent correct so you get your spoon and get half of this for the lip balm I'm going to make use of half of this so I'm making use of half of Vaseline then the next amazing ingredient that I'm going to put is my coconut oil yeah you can put coconut oil you can use another type of oil you have like olive oil it can also work the same but I would prefer this and I've melted my coconut oil already so I'm going to get one tablespoon depending but the amount depends on what you want to make let me add a little so there are two tablespoons of coconut oil and half big spoon of Vaseline so the ingredients are beetroot juice Vaseline for our lip balm so you put these ones aside and then you continue mixing with the beetroot juice so what we do we need now is our beetroot juice you are going to get this and mix first of all we first mix these two ingredients we mix the coconut oil and the vaseline together together and then we are going to add one tablespoon of beetroot juice so after i have mixed you see it is so soft you get your beetroot juice and then you put in your in your vaseline and and top my car so guys, as you can see, I already have my my lip balm oil, lip balm, beetroot lip balm, and I have just used coconut oil. And you see how it looks so beautiful. So if you like, you can go ahead and melt these three ingredients so that the three ingredients can blend totally well but i'm not going to to double boil mine or put them in uh, to melt them because i already had already melted my vaseline and my coconut oil as you can see it is already melted so there is no need to put it in a double boiler method but if your coconut oil is in solid form you have to make sure that you put this in a double boiler method it is so simple you got just get a bowl like this then you get hot water like this one you get hot water and then you put in your bowl and then you place your ingredients your container where you have put so you just put hot water like this and then you put you place your vaseline and your coconut and beetroot lip balm in there so that it can melt and blend so well but I had melted my coconut oil so the melting process is going to be so easy and simple for me so as you can see I'm double boiling so when you put this in hot water the three ingredients blend so so well nicely and they are so soft that you can easily use on your mouth so what you do after i have got this melted lip balm you put this 
container aside and then you get a container where you're going to put or to keep your beetroot leaf balm from this is so amazing it is so natural and so beautiful the ingredients are only beetroot juice vaseline vaseline and coconut oil for this beautiful amazing lip balm so what you do you get your container or you get something where you're going to keep your lip balm from and then you keep your lip balm vaseline coconut oil and beetroot juice for this amazing lip balm so i'm going to get my container where i'm going to keep my lip balm from and i start applying it on my mouth and this is going to help me and save me a lot because i'll be sure that i don't have any chemical on my mouth so guys this is how we are going to keep it in this container and this is so so beautiful when you apply it on your mouth you're going to achieve pink lips you're going to have pink beautiful lips and you're going to look so so beautiful so the ingredient depends if you want to make too much or in large quantities you double the ingredients like you can make use of full tablespoon of, of, of vaseline then you add on the quantity of coconut oil and also on the beetroot juice so guys this is how my ingredient is this is my lip balm for beautiful pink lips using the uh, beetroot vaseline and coconut oil so what we do after i have made this you just go ahead and keep this in the fridge and it can last for three months you put it in the fridge and you can apply it whenever you want so this is how it looks mm. for pink lips you can make your lip balm using mm. guys you see pink lips with just using This is so beautiful. It is going to help you moisturize your mouth, your lips. You're going to achieve pink lips. You're going to be so sure of the ingredients and you're not going to be stressed with the chemicals and the preservative in your lip balm because you have made it yourself. Guys, see how it looks so, so beautiful. Just using Vaseline, beetroot juice and coconut oil for this pink, beautiful lip. Thank you so much, guys, for watching me. You can keep this in the fridge. You can keep this in your fridge and use it whenever you need. And then it can last for at least three months without getting bad and then you can just apply anytime you need in the morning at night and then you are going to achieve be beautiful pink soft moisturized lips when you use beetroot lip balm and you can do this only by yourself at home thank you so much for watching me guys see you in the next video please subscribe